200 families and carers gathered outside Kirkley Town Hall yesterday to protest at proposed cuts. They say the council's plans will return disabled adults to the dark days of being hidden from view. A consultation into exactly what care should be provided has just ended. Currently, those eligible have substantial or critical needs, depending on their health and social circumstances. The consultation has considered restricting care only to those with critical needs. I think it's a backwards step because vulnerable people, these are people who can only relate to very often their own friends during the daytime. Yes. My own daughter, for example, 42, uh, can't really understand what's happening. She yes. can't understand the, how the money's spent, where it comes from, or where it goes to. She couldn't look after herself in that way. She would have to live with an, an 83 year old man. Right. Which is no existence for a middle aged young lady. And she, she needs the social of, interaction of daycare, her, is that? She has all her friends in the daycare service. Right, yeah. And yeah. from there, she's able to go out and do voluntary work. Yeah. She's able to do a small pay job, which she gets a small wage for. Yeah. And her whole life depends on what happens during the daytime. Yeah. Now, if, if we don't, if we close down any of those services, day services, and yeah. deny them that, she'll have to spend all the time with me. Okay. Which is no doubt. That's why I'm saying it's like putting them away into a home or putting them out of sight of society. Yeah, okay. That's a retrograde step.